Wisconsin governor visiting Northside Elementary in La Crosse today to announce a $90 million investment into K-12 education statewide. Now that money will come from federal COVID-19 relief funds and is meant to set uh, to address staffing issues school districts are facing and provide direct classroom support. The investment also includes $15 million to be added to the governor's Get Kids Ahead initiative for mental health services. The governor says he will continue to invest in education in future budgets. This next budget is going to be a critical one for the for the legislature and for our schools. And uh, I look forward to being governor then and provide, providing a very robust uh, uh, proposal for the legislature to take on. Now, when he was asked about President Biden's Labor Day trip to Milwaukee, Governor Evers said He's looking forward to discussing labor issues with the president and a spokeswoman for Republican Tim Michaels, Evers' main challenger on the November ballot, accuses the governor in a statement of handing out the money now, quote, so he can pretend to care about education. Evers served as Wisconsin's secretary of education prior to being elected as governor.